Hello children, it's story time again. And today I would like to share a secret with you. Well, every day we keep hearing about coronavirus. The schools are shut, all the shops are closed, and I was a bit worried. And then I read this book. And today I'm gonna read this book to you. The title of this book is Dave the dog is worried about coronavirus. It's written and illustrated by Molly Watts. There was an owl called Dotty, a nurse with a uniform all spotty. She works in the hospital up the hill, looking after all the children who are ill. Near to Dottie, there lives a dog called Dave, who every morning gives Nurse Dottie a wave. But this morning, Dave doesn't have his normal big grin, because there is something really worrying him. There has been talk about coronavirus everywhere. And hearing about it is giving Dave a big scare. It is on the TV at home and school every day. Dave is worried that everything won't be okay. Dave is anxious and Nurse Dottie can see that. So she decides to stop for a chat. There is a lot of different and scary thing being said. So Nurse Dotty wants to make sure Dave knows the truth instead. Nurse Dotty tells Dave that coronavirus is an illness that some people will get, but that most people will not get really poorly from it. Children, the word poorly means unwell or sick. And another word for coronavirus is COVID-19. For most, it is like a cold or flu they might get when it's colder. But we should be careful to protect ourselves and those who are unwell or older. Dave asks if it is true that someone has it if they are coughing a lot. Nurse Dottie says, Coughing is a symptom, but it might not be coronavirus they've got. With coronavirus, they may get a fever and be a bit short of breath too. But these things are also symptoms of a cold or flu. Nurse Dottie said, washing his hand is the most important thing they should do. It should be for at least 20 seconds or singing happy birthday twice through. This will help to try stop him from getting coronavirus himself. And it's a way that Dave can help to protect everybody else. To be safe, if Dave gets poorly, he will have to stay at home. But his family would stay with him, so he would not be alone. If he's been near others who are poorly, then he will stay home then too. There will be plenty of food and lots of games and things to do. Children, remember the word poorly means unwell or sick? Many things have been cancelled and they will not be able to go on holiday. Also, he might not see people he normally does, as at home they may need to stay. Schools and shops have also closed to stop lots of people being all together. But just for now, to keep people safe, it will not be forever. Dave has a grandma and he knows she is a little bit old. He is worried because coronavirus is more dangerous for her, he has been told. 
Nurse Dotty says that it may make her more poorly than it would him or his sister. But that is why she will stay at home, and they will take what she needs to her. Dave asks, will he need to visit Nurse Dotty at the hospital? Nurse Dotty explains that's, that no, that's not the case at all. If he is poorly, then home is the best place for him to stay. Unless he needs some help, only then would to hospital he make his way. Now, study explains that on TV and everywhere, people will say lots of things. But no matter what they fears, we are ready for what coronavirus brings. To keep everyone safe is the reason that there are all these plans. All Dave needs to do is stay calm and remember to wash his hands. Now Dave knows the truth. He is no longer scared. He knows what to do to keep himself prepared. He knows to keep washing his hands and if poorly at home he has to stay. But most of all, now he knows he is going to be okay. Well, children, isn't that a beautiful story? Now, there are a few things that we all need to keep in mind. One, we don't have to worry and get scared. We have to stay calm. Two, we have to keep washing our hands. And that too, four. 20 seconds and we need to sleep well eat healthy food and also we have to stay at home and stay safe yes and i will see you soon happy reading happy learning bye bye